I'm very honored to be here to testify in support of H.R. 1922, which is a bill to designate the Jupiter in lighthouse, Inlet Lighthouse and the surrounding federal land as an outstanding natural area. I'm here today representing both the town and the working group to ask for your support. A support for a bill which will preserve and enhance what is not only a unique local icon of a very special significance to the people of the Jupiter to West area, but also has significant national, historic, and environmental value. Archaeological evidence of Native American habitation dates back to 3000 BC. Ponce de Leon sailed into the Jupiter and they're looking for that fountain of youth, as have many of our uh, residents since then. But during World War II, the site contained a top secret U.S. naval radio <coughs> station, which monitored and detected most of the 67 German submarines which were destroyed off the coast of Florida. Every community has a special place that provides meaning and identity to its people, and the Jupiter Inlet Area Lighthouse has been and continues to be such a place for the people of Jupiter. In a region where most people are born elsewhere, the lighthouse and natural area have enabled citizens to come together, mold a community identity, and become stakeholders in their community and government. The Jupiter Inlet Lighthouse is much more than a beacon of light safely guiding mariners around the inlet. It's a monument to Florida's history and our nation's history. Since the lighthouse's construction in 1860, it has played an important role during military conflicts and has facilitated commerce. Today, the light still guides boaters safely home.